Y'all got a film of the feet, so let's get into this tea. We about to get into Kaisenet reacts to NPC Miles and Pinky Doll. Let's get it. Kaisenet reacts to Pinky Doll and NPC Miles, two big TikTokers that are popular for. You guys want me to rub some baby oil down him? You should subscribe with 50 gifted subs. What? Don't do it. <laughs> don't, don't do 50 gifted. Hey. Wow. <laughs> you fell in Pinky Doll hard. Pinky Doll love you. Huh? Bianca, money gun. Rumors are that they possibly could be dating. It's <sighs> Three, two, one, and aura. Hey, get down, Theo. What's going on? Man, Miles, you missed it, man. Uh, Big missed step it. up. Big step up. Big step up. That's my, boy. my man. Miles! Congratulations! Oh. I seen the pop out. You fuck with Pinky? You and Pinky Dog, nigga! You and Pinky I, Dog, I see y'all on the day. I see y'all on the day in the Karen's I'm like, he do not want to dab up, dude. That's it, Mary Jane? That shit motivated me. That's fire, bro. That's it, Mary Jane? I Talk said to, to me, my come man, Miles. You know we the best. Big step up. Happy to be here. Big step up. Yeah. That's you know, it, washing your laundry up. every night. Yeah. Oh. Every night, he come in like a fresh batch. Smell like downy. <laughs> <laughs> Bounty. Nah, y'all mind your business, man. Mind your business. Mind your business. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Queen Aja now has this young man crushing on her after she accidentally accepts his request to join her TikTok live. Me personally, out of marriage already. But y'all have a good day though. I didn't mean to answer that. I was going to decline it. I'm sorry. I was going to decline it because I was going to go to sleep. Type shit. <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna go. I was gonna go to sleep. I'm sorry, I need to accept it. But how are you? I'm all right. You be battling? Battling what? You gonna battle like on TikTok? Rap battle? It's the queen. <laughs> so if I said this, you know what this is? Oh, I did that to somebody before. Yeah. Exactly. So we can do well, it. Battle. I'm tired though. No, like. Ooh. I'm sleepy though. I can't. I can't do it. Okay. You sleep. You that sleepy that you can't battle. Well, I got kids. I gotta wake up and get to my kids. How many kids you got? Okay, we're not doing this. I'm I'm sleepy. Okay. I'm sorry. All right. You be safe. Have a good night. Okay. You too. How do I get off of here though? I don't know how to do it. I got you. Okay. Are, you gonna, are we gonna be Are we gonna be mutuals to battle again, or I just catch you when I catch you? You probably gonna have to catch me. All right. Okay, Lord. No, I did it by accident, y'all. Don't do that. Don't be making stuff out of nothing. It was too long. Don't make some. I I accidentally accepted that. Don't do that. I'm not trying to get in trouble by my man. <laughs> I'm trying to get in trouble by my man. I know for real. So quick. I don't want to look at this man, y'all. Queen has always talked like. Like, not say, not like she was moaning. She just got that voice that sounds, obviously a man will be intrigued by her voice. Let me just say that, I guess. So I feel like they take it the wrong way and she's nice. You know what I'm saying? But I genuinely feel like she didn't know how to hang up. I genuinely feel like she wasn't trying to be rude. I also genuinely feel like if Clarence was right beside her, if dude kept the same energy, he probably would have just hung up on the nigga and cussed him out. And I don't think Clarence is mad. But anyway. Queen Naja, it's reported that Queen Naja, why the fuck am I talking like this? Chill, twin. But no, Queen Naja had accepted this dude on her TikTok live yesterday. And when she accepted him, she got very, very, very nervous. And we were trying to figure out, like, why you nervous, girl? You said you wanted to accept him. But when she accepted the dude, she said she didn't mean to accept it. But right before she accepted, she said, let me accept this request. So that don't even make sense. <laughs> that, don't, that don't make sense. And then she was like real nervous. She was looking like real nervous. I think because he was a an attractive looking man. Okay. I think that's what was the issue. Because he was. Y'all. <coughs> why? Why are everybody acting like. You can't look at a person and be like, oh, shit. That motherfucker fine. 
Oh, oh shit. I don't ex- oh, okay. Damn. I don't even know how to get off this motherfucker. He's a nice looking guy, but I don't even know how to get up off this. Y'all know I'd be quick to be like, uh uh-uh, uh, you ain't about to get me in no shit. Hell no. That's basically what she was saying, but <clears throat> Queen is not that fast with it. You know what I'm saying? So, cause um, I don't I don't have time for that. Depends on the dynamic of the relationship. Honey <laughs> talk. What emoji is that? <laughs> what is that? <coughs> like, yeah, he attractive, but I don't want you. Right. That's all I'm saying. But she didn't give me she want him either. She like, I think she was trying to find a reason to get the hell off. She could have very well accepted it on accident or she could have very well accepted it on purpose. Now, you don't, I'll knock all the black off you emoji. <laughs> You don't have to knock the black off of me. Um, I just, I don't feel like she meant no harm. It was like, if you like real ugly, I feel like she was, you know what I'm saying? She wouldn't have been, you know, scared. But then she was like, I don't want to get in trouble for my man. Girl, he is about this tall. How you scared of him? But, um, yeah, what are you going to do? For the record, Clarence is way taller than queen he may not be way taller than chris but i think well they've seen each other in person but i think that um y'all don't know that but uh well y'all should know that because they had to get divorced and shit but anyway um they had to be there anyway uh chris is just six six feet tall and clarence is probably like five eleven. clarence is way taller than me and i mean i'm short <laughs> but queen is shorter than me so Clarence is taller than both of us. <laughs> that makes any sense. But Chris is way taller, child. He just do too much shady ass Dude, take lady. This at you, boy. He's you such a shady with? lady. Y'all. Anyways, how y'all feel about this? <laughs> he will I'm really sorry, get on my nerves. I'm just trolling you. I'm not. I'm not. Nah, serious. Queen is more like five one, but he will really get on my nerves if this was my baby daddy. Queen and Clarence, if y'all see this video, I'm not serious. But if y'all see this, I love y'all, and um, I'm out. Call me back. I'm gonna catch her. Right? Listen, listen. She, she said hi to me. I'm gonna catch her. And I ain't gonna let you go. <laughs> if she ha- if she say hi to me, I'm gonna catch it. Exactly. I, listen, I was very respectful. I would have said was. I just would have put a ring on already. Me personally. Me personally. You feel me? It don't take me that long. Me personally, I know what I want. In a couple months. Sir, she don't want you. You nice looking guy. Definitely a nice looking guy. But my nigga, I don't know why niggas do this for somebody who already taken. Like, bro, let it go. I'm talking about go get you a lookalike. You're wasting your time. <laughs> and it looks so stupid and thirsty. I don't get it. It's just this this be some thirsty shit right here. You thought we were flirting? I didn't think she was flirting. I think we was. Ha- she I- definitely was not flirting, bro. I thought we was just being having a normal conversation. I was getting I was a little bit. I was getting a little bit of hate. I was like, damn, why I'm getting hate comments? I'm I'm just I'm a I'm a regular civilian. You getting hate comments because you kept going, and she's literally trying to tell you I'm out. And then this nigga gonna say, is this like a regular thing? Or you trying to get to know her, asking about the kids. That's why she like, I'm not doing this. The reason why she said she wasn't doing this because she seen the nigga was trying to make conversation with her. If he wasn't interested, he wouldn't be making conversation. And y'all know that. You do not have to get to know me. You do not need to know how many kids I got. You don't need to know nothing, nigga. I'm going to sleep. I ain't mean to answer it. Bye. Why we hanging on me? Look, people keep tagging me. I'm not trying to be messy. People is tagging me. Y'all yeah, regular civilian. Y'all yeah, don't want no beat, no BB up. She's still singing to the rap. Yeah. Not the rap battle? Nah, that shit killed me. I was like, damn, rap battle? I don't blame him for wanting the battle because he could get some money from that battle. But outside of that, like. Listen, I'm about to. I'm going to see her. I'm going to see her. I'm going to see her DM. I'm going to be like, listen. I'm going to say, like, listen, I just want to be. I just want to be cordial. 
Why is he sending her a DM to be cordial? I just wanna be cordial. And be, be friends. And get to know each other as friends. I'm not gonna lie. This shit right here be so weird, bro. It's one thing to give a person a compliment like, oh my God, you look good. Thanks. Y'all, we are attractive people. Some of us, some of us, some of us <laughs> are attractive people. So when somebody be like, yeah, girl, cause you fine. All right, thanks. You are, you know, you're beautiful. Honey sauce don't like certain words I say I've noticed. I definitely can't call you fine. That's a dub. Okay. But I can say she's a nice looking woman. She's beautiful. And I can only say it one time. Um, I, I do that because I, I'm clearly reacting to a video. So I can't just be like, she, all right. Then yeah, me, she ain't, I, I don't have time for that. Nice looking woman. Like he's a nice looking guy. Right. But it's like, all right, that's it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, what are we doing? And, and, and we don't need any more. We don't need any more her. Oh my God, he's thirsty and I don't like it. And he looked too good to be acting like this. Go get you a single woman. Okay? That don't have a nigga. I'm going to just slide in her shit. And you going to say it publicly? I'm going to just slide in her shit and be like, you know, I just want to be cordial and be friends. Man, get out of here, bro. And he don't even sound like he trolling. I'm not going to lie. He don't sound like he trolling. I'm going to respect your relationship. Then you already disrespecting my relationship by sliding in my DMs. You did what you did on the phone. Cool. We done with the phone. Now you slide in my DM. Like, what are we doing? See, I want to respect your relationship, but I just want to get to know you as a friend. That's nothing else. <sighs> You're not better than Clarence. Okay. I respect you. Just, I respect how you feel. I'm not trying. I'm not comparing myself to nobody. I'm a, I'm a human. That's a human. That's this woman. I'm just, I'm just trying to be the friend. Side eyeing the situation, y'all leave y'all comments down below. Wish y'all thoughts on Mr. Steal Your Girl. Here's what Chris Sales had to say about the whole situation. Neek explains her breakup with oh, Dwayne. Sure Dwayne that. also speaks out as well. Me and Dwayne together, and I said, No, we are no longer together. And I also said that we weren't fit for each other. I guess I can address this right now. And why am I touching this base? Because I told myself that I really wasn't gonna like come on here and just make it like a big thing because we it's, it's literally I'm about to not pee. it's a big thing <laughs> on his end or my end. We just both decided that we were gonna go our separate ways but I hate the narrative that everybody I didn't see multiple comments of people going basically saying like oh well she fumbled this and she fumbled that I, she wasn't she was doing this and she was outside she was ready to party and she was doing that you guys literally don't know what goes on behind closed doors y'all don't know what happens in real life we're not in the relationship that we were in that we shared together and because we decided to separate that's just that's just what it is. I just hate the narrative of like, no, you guys, we're walking on the path that God gave us, and we basically just trying to figure it out. And maybe I shouldn't answer the question, but, and I just put it on myself because I'm just putting it out there. And once you put something out there, like, literally, you give people, like, you know, a chance to just speak on your situation. Is single. <laughs> <laughs> what you say? Shit, single. <laughs> Austin McBroom speaks out after the mother of his child, Catherine, posts her new boyfriend. I am unbothered. The kids come first, as you guys know. You guys think that I find out the news when you guys find out the news. That's false. <clears throat> I've been known about the news. I've actually met him. Not once. I will never be petty to where it affects my kids. Kids will always come first. You guys, just keep pushing me. You keep pushing me. That's where I'm at. And like I said, you guys aren't the only one doing that to me. I know you guys see it. I don't Someone keeps poking the bear. Do whatever your soul, whatever your chakras are telling you to do. But always remember the kids first. And minding my damn business. And that's fine. That's fine. The least I can do is share my side of the story. There's <laughs> two sides to every story. I would like one He's side. definitely you sick. No, right? Definitely sick. Actually, if one person is unhappy, then like that other person is unhappy, right? Like you guys have- One thing we know he good at is acting.
I bet Catherine was looking at that shit like. Have a great day. Um, had I not felt comfortable to and um, one of them being my children, like my like my children absolutely love Igor and like I would have never shared it had, you know, they didn't have a great relationship relationship with him so um just things like that not that like that's like the main focus is with you had um had i not felt there's a lot of questions and i definitely want to answer a lot of these questions uh, i do want to wait for um igor to get back in town because he's actually in miami right now for work um uh, introduce him to you guys and i can't believe i'm even saying that because <laughs> A year ago, I would have been like, that. I'm never going to do that. Like, no. I wish you wouldn't. Mm -mm. <coughs> <coughs> You're going to be doing a video every other day. I'm not trying to be petty with Austin. I don't care. Uh, and then if you can't speak English, Catherine. Well, how are we going to talk to him? <laughs> Like, obviously the people that can, can, but the people that can't. We would need translation on a video. Is that a thing? Can you translate from English to Spanish? I mean, from Spanish to English via, via CC on the video? Like, is that a thing? You know, when you hit a C on the keyboard, you can see the closed captions. Yeah. Can you translate those from Spanish to English so we know what he's saying? And y'all think I'm being funny. I'm being dead ass serious because how the hell we going to know what he's talking about? I want to know what he's saying. I need to learn Spanish. Okay. <laughs> like, I'm never going to do that. And still, even right now, I'm like, what? What am I doing? I want you guys to know him because he is such a beautiful, special person, and I can't even believe I'm saying that. Like, that is so vulnerable of me. Like, the old me would have been like, oh, hell no, I'm keeping that to myself. I am not, no, no. Still do it. Keep it to yourself, still. Keep it to yourself. No evil eye against us. Oh, child, she don't even know the can of worms she just opened up. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. I'm done with this video. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hey, yeah.